It was evacuated because the building was too dangerous. Now firefighters are getting a new fire headquarters. As News Channel 5's Kyle Horan learned, it has been a year now since firefighters there have had a permanent home base. It may not look like much, but the rubble behind me used to be the old Hendersonville main fire station, and it's soon to be a brand new fire station. It was evacuated because of safety issues, and the why of that is what makes the story so interesting. At first glance, this site off Freehill Road in Hendersonville looks like a dump. But when Deputy Chief Michael Holt looks at it, he sees potential, but also memories. So we had 10 people in the downstairs area. The upstairs area, which was level with the road, we had engine two was permanently assigned here. It was four people assigned here. We also had rescue one assigned here. The upstairs area and the design of the building are where the trouble starts. From what I understand, this building predates myself and the fire chief. It was a fire station for us always, but before that, supposedly it was public works building. So I believe they had like pickup truck. I'm assuming they would probably have pickup trucks or dump trucks, or I don't know, some stuff, something like that. Not nearly as heavy as a fire engine. Imagine this, you're at work and all of a sudden the roof comes down about two inches. And you know above you, the truck can weigh as much as 20 tons. That's what happened every time the fire engine pulled into the old fire hall. But it did look like it was moving about that much. About two inches. Yeah, just the, the movement of the drop ceiling. Pretty scary. The uh, first engineer, when he seen that, uh, he acted like he wanted to kind of run on out of the building. Now firefighters here are at a nearby public works location, but it's not ideal. A small attic and a garage that they share with multiple departments, but it's a good launching point to keep people safe. So that was like in April of last year. Okay. And uh, sometime in June of last year, all the administrative people, all 10 of us from downstairs, moved to an office building across from City Hall. It's been a year and those who worked here hope to have a new building soon. In Hendersonville, Kyle Brand News Channel 5. Kyle, thanks. There are plans in the works to create a new fire hall, but still nothing's been finalized just yet.